Hello and welcome back. I did the last video expecting like at least one or two views, but I got over 13, so I'm happy that at least 10 people stayed. In this video, I know it's GTA 4. It's probably because it was easier for me to record GTA 4 since I want to wait for a little while to get back into GTA 5 spirit and then play it and enjoy it instead of like, you know, playing it and feeling like I need to play it. Because I'm really pumped for playing GTA 5 again, but I'm gonna wait a little bit until I finish GTA 4. On PC, this this is I'm actually showing off the Eye Enhancer mod. This is the 2.3, not 2.2 version or something like that, 2.1. The reason that is because two I don't. This is not exactly a Steam copy of GTA 5, if you know what I mean. I do. Uh, <clears throat> I borrow it from the internet, so yeah. Borrow it and play it, and then when I get bored of it, I uninstall it, which I doubt I'll be uninstalling this game since I wanted to play it on PC for like five years. Uh, so, yeah, if you want to see more GTA 4, because I can do so much content on it, it is so much fun to play. As you can see here, I was showing off the bike a second ago, like the graphics and stuff. YouTube doesn't allow you to see the graphics in full enhanced mod if you move a lot. But if you stop and like for like two seconds, just look at one one little like one image, it will actually show you the full 180p processed image. Fuck. Headshot. Anyways, that was a little thing. And here's a comet, aka the Porsche 911 Sports Classic. This is like the more if you remember the classic version. This is like. This is what I was looking for. I wasn't looking for anything fancy to install. I've got a couple of mods in this. I got the Iron Answer. I've got the first person mod, but I don't use the first person mod because oh my 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 reasons. I thought it would be more exciting. I've got a couple of car mods. I am only putting up five car mods max because it does this taxi bug thing when you put more than five or more than ten even. As soon as you get up up to like seven plus, that's when the uh, when the taxi bug hits. You can fix that by downloading traffic, lo traffic, this is by the way how you lower your car I'm showing right now. You can use traffic loader or something like that, traffic organizer or real traffic. Just look it up on the internet, like taxi bug fix, and it'll show you like some via YouTube videos with like download links. Don't watch the video if you don't want any, just copy and paste the files in your GTA folder. Just in case, you know, there might be someone watching that wants to play GTA 4 and they want to know how to do this stuff. They want to mod cars in it. I will do later on. As soon as, eventually, I will get pissed off at all these old cars. I'm gonna mod in all the new ones. The reason I don't use that is because it spawns in a lot of uh, supercars, like not supercars, but mostly supercars. Say I wanted to get like a Turismo to be a Ferrari. There'll be like Ferraris like every now and then. And I don't like that. In this, in normal mode, you get Ferrari, aka the Turismo, pretty rare. I mean, I've got the Colin Segarra as my Infernus. Although the video has to come to an end, it's not the end of the channel or the videos. So yeah, I'm back, I just wanted to say that, uh, not that anybody cares, certainly I don't. I did seem dull in this video, but that's because I'm trying to explain something to you. So, thanks, and see you in the other video. This is not meant to be funny, by the way, this is just an update.